Hello everyone, myself Bharadwaj. In this course, I will show you how to integrate smart transmitters data into the DCS system using different approach. If you see in industries, mostly we use 4 to 20 milliamp based smart instruments. In this video, if you see, this is one level transmitter for measuring the level and this is second level transmitter and we have control walls. These two are control walls. All these instruments operates on 4 to 20 milliamp signals. That means the interface between these instruments and our DCS system typically 4 to 20 milliamp based signals. The 4 milliamp represents lower range value and 20 milliamp represents upper range value of a process signal. Okay, if you see here this TT temperature transmitter, this instrument measures the temperature and sends as a 4 to 20 milliamp based signal to the DCS system. The DCS receives this 4 to 20 milliamp signal and converts into equivalent temperature value and then displays onto the graphics for the operator. Right? Like that, in industries, we have so many instruments like level transmitters, pressure transmitters, flow transmitters, or any instruments. Mostly, they use 4 to 20 milliamp signals and they are heart based instruments. We have other instruments also available in industries like field bus, foundation field bus, trophy bus, etc. But the most common and popular type is heart based smart instruments. Next, I will show you some introduction videos about the basics of 4 to 20 milliamp signals and then heart signal. And then I will show you how to configure step by step to fetch the transmitter's data using heart protocol. Okay. Thank you. I will meet you in the next video.